BAL TV 11 editorial board. Here is President and General Manager Dan Jarrett. Do you remember the time when you greeted strangers as they passed by on the street? What about the person who held the door for you or saw a young boy helping an elderly woman across the street? Acts of civility are a hallmark of our country. Unfortunately, a lack of respect seems to be commonplace today. We see it in our politics and we even see it in our communities. Earlier this year, we told you about a sign in a Dunkin' Donuts in North Baltimore that promoted xenophobia and expressed bias towards non-English speaking employees. This week, the 11 News team discovered another sign inside a local business. A Catonsville businessman posted this sign after his store was recently robbed. It warned customers that if they entered the store wearing a mask or hoodie, it would be considered trespassing and that the police would be called. With his son in mind, a local father took exception to the sign's wording. My nine-year-old, as part of his outfit of choice, often wears a hoodie. So I just wouldn't want to feel like I sent my son across the street to grab something to eat, and then he runs the risk of having the police called on him. So that was my primary concern. That father then wisely acted, offering a sign that could be more palatable to the public. The business owner listened and willingly accepted the new sign. Their example should serve as a model for us. When confronted with an issue that requires sensitivity, choose civility first. WBAL-TV welcomes responsible replies to this editorial.